messages. You had no communication with my office. Um, I would have hoped that that had occurred. Um, you know, the reality is we've been waiting for quite some time. Four officer involved shooting cases in our area now closed by the Chatham County District Attorney tonight. Even the mayor is looking for answers. Good evening, I'm Ben Singer. It's nice to be back with you. Tina will be joining us a little later in the newscast. Stay tuned for that. Today's top story at six. The Chatham County District Attorney back in the hot seat after WSAB's investigative unit learns the investigations into four different officer involved shootings are now over. WSAB's Edward Moody is here with more on why you haven't heard about these cases being closed. Well, Ben, simply put, we haven't heard because District Attorney Shalina Jones never announced her findings or decisions in any of those cases. We had to find out from the Georgia Bureau of Investigation. Now, we've also learned that she didn't just close these cases recently. She did it back in March. Now, three of those cases were part of a string of officer involved shootings in early 2022. Five in all, one of the closed cases dates as far back as December of 2020. The GBI tells News 3 that all of them were closed with, quote, no judicial action by the Chatham County DA's office. Not only did District Attorney Jones close the cases without informing the public, we learned today that Mayor Van Johnson's office wasn't informed either. Because there's so much attention on when the incident happened, I think that those officers uh, deserve that public vindication as well. Now we have reached out to the district attorney and her, her spokesperson for comment. We have yet to hear back from them. We have also put in an open records request for all documents connected to these cases and her decisions on them. Edward Moody, WSAV News 3 on your side. Edward, thank you. And we are still waiting on a decision from the Chatham County District Attorney on another officer involved shooting that we've been telling you about. June 24th will mark one year since former Savannah Police Officer Ernest Ferguson shot and killed 31 year old Saudi Lee in the Carver Heights neighborhood. The GBI gave the DA's office their report on the officer involved shooting in August of last year. She has yet to make a decision on whether to charge Ferguson.